Josie? Josie? Josie, wake up! You should try kissing her, maybe. I know this is a fairy tale and all, but a non-consensual kiss is never the answer. Well, excuse me, little Miss Big Words. You got a better idea. I do. Soldier Day. Hey! We said no magic. I know you're scared of the darkness, but this is Josie's subconscious. Nothing can really hurt us here. Sweetheart, and it could definitely hurt us. <laughs> little pig, little pig, who's your new friend? I can smell that magic's being used here again. Happy now? You dumb broad. You nearly got us both eaten. Which is a lifelong fear of mine, I'll have you know. And now, the darkness knows your magic using ass is here. Yeah? Well, my magic just saved our asses. After I pulled you to safe. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much for pulling me behind a single piece of rebel. What do you want from me? I got hoops for him. I want you to stop ducking down to me and be grateful that I just saved our bacon. How dare you? I'm sorry. It's just a figure of speech, all right? Look, Drews, okay? We both miss Josie. We can work together to wake her up. If we do that, the darkness will only grow again. Princess Josie did what she did for a reason. She made her sacrifice because she didn't know that help was coming. So if we can't wake her up, then we're just gonna have to defeat the darkness ourselves. 